crikey, that's quite an opening. I'm Roger Heaton and this is Hymnos, my second album for clarinet and saxophone classics. This Hymnos disc, uh, like my first multi-tracked album for clarinet and saxophone classics, also originated from ballet performances. Back in 1988, Richard Alston decided to choreograph Hymnos, Maxwell Davis's piece, for the Rombert Dance Company. And I asked the original performer of the piece, Stephen Pruslin, the pianist, who played in Peter Maxwell Davis's group, The Fires of London, if he'd like to tour it with me. Amazingly, he said yes, and we played over 50 performances. Uh, all over the world with Gondo. It's a real tour de force, very dramatic, but also it's very, very tricky. And it has famously one of the highest clarinet notes in the repertoire, this super high E flat you have to play as loud as you possibly can. We built a programme around him loss that was influenced by my clarinet teacher, Alan Hacker, who also played the first performance of him loss. So apart from the three little piano pieces, which were first recordings and Precy that Steve played, this is very much an album of pieces inspired by and written for Hacker, uh, by really the three most important composers working in Britain at the time that he worked with Maxwell Davis, Bertwistle and Gurr. Harry Bertwistle came to the recording session for the, um, for the clarinet quintet with the Kreutzer Quartet and actually he changed and tweaked a few, um, a few little things. Um, apart from the quintet, the other pieces are all from the late 1960s and they're all still very much part of the adventurous clarinetist's repertoire, with quite a few young players playing particularly hymnos and Gers solo piece paraphrase. Even after all these years, these are still really challenging pieces to play, uh, but they're hugely rewarding for both the player and the listener. <laughs> 